All right, YouTubers. Well, I finally got my uh, weather station that I decided to go with. Uh, I went with the Accurite 5-in-1 weather station uh, professional, it says. Uh, so this is a box. Uh, it comes with a, you know, wind direction, uh, the monitor. I mean, it does quite a bit of stuff. Uh, the only gripe I got with it is if you go to their website, you cannot download that PC Connect software that you need if you want to hook it into your computer or on your cell phone. For whatever reason, I cannot download it. But as far as the unit itself connecting to its uh, display monitor, that works just fine. I mean, you know, it would have been nice to been able to get it hooked to the internet so I can check it at home. But, you know, that's, nah, that's not a real biggie. So, uh, and this is the box on the front side, so we'll go to a couple side shots. Alright, here's a side shot, uh, just, you know, kind of showing you a little cutout. Uh, get your wind speed indicator here. It says high speed wind, uh, uh, for precision bearing, optical sensor for tracking motion, which is for your weather vane. Lord's balance, uh, yada, 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 your rain collector cup. Uh, it takes uh, four AA batteries, uh, lithium I put, uh, I gotta take it back down tomorrow, I put it up today, and I put cheaper batteries in it, so I gotta go out and get better batteries, that's gonna last longer, and yeah, and it uh, works down to, I think, yeah, it works down to minus 40 degrees, and in the manual it says, if, you know, freezing rain, this freezes up, and that freezes up your weather vane and wind speed indicator, it's not gonna damage your unit, so that's pretty good there. So now we'll go to the next side of the box. Okay, on this side of the box, uh, it you know it tells again Accurite Wi-Fi Weather Center. You got the five-in-one weather sensor, completely wireless, easy to install. Which <laughs> that's a little misleading. Don't believe that. Get the color home display, the free online access, upload your weather data to the world's largest online weather station network view weather conditions and other underground blah 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 but unfortunately you need that software from their website to connect to your computer but every time i tried it on five different pcs and i cannot download that software so that part ain't going to work and i don't know why and i'll be contacting them uh well it's the weekend now so probably won't be till tuesday and find out why they're linked to download that uh, PC Connect software ain't working and you do need that but overall I mean you don't really need that I just like it because I'm mobile all the time and I like to be able to you know once I set my account up I can watch it on my phone and whatever but as far as the unit goes with the included uh, display unit that connected just fine there was no issues whatsoever as soon as you put the batteries in there bam it it bound everything as long as you had your channels you got a b c i think d i think there's four channels but you just make sure they all match either a to a b to b c to c d to d you get the rest and they all work fine mine was on channel a and uh all righty well Here's what I got now in my shack. I got uh, the Yaesu DX10, uh, my external monitor, speakers, uh, electronic tuner, dummy load, and this one right there. Right there. That is my uh, five-in-one weather station that uh, I can monitor wind, rain, temperature, wind speed, and all that other good stuff. And that's all I really wanted was for the wind speed because my antenna is mounted to a 20-foot uh, tower makeshift. Uh, so I get everything else. For my actual, I got actually 60-foot of tower to put up, but I don't have the time right now to do it. So it's on a makeshift 20-foot tower and an additional 10-foot uh, mass pipe. So that puts uh, the antenna up 30 feet. And the antenna itself is a HF vertical, which is about 23 and a half feet in size itself. So what is that? Somewhere around 50 some foot. So I want to be able to monitor the wind. Uh, the antenna is rated supposedly for 75 miles an hour or somewhere around in there. But you know, I just uh, want to be able to monitor that there. The temperature and everything else is nice, but I was more concerned about the wind speed. But, uh, but yeah, this is a, uh, this is what my setup looks like now, and I'm 
getting pretty close to finishing building my rig out, I really did want to get a weather station uh, specifically for how high that antenna sits up there and to measure the wind. And I got uh, that antenna, or excuse me, weather station at Lowe's, and it was only like 116 bucks and some change out the door. So I got no complaints out of that. And, you know, other than it's not connecting to the internet or anything like that, I don't really care. Uh, it'd be nice, but yeah, here's what I got now, and I'm really happy with it. So let me tell you, uh, tell me what you think. Uh, if anyone has any ideals, uh, an alternate version or a link to get that software to run into my computer, I'd appreciate it. But other than that, all right, guys, 73.